Hi everyone, I'm back again, pain treatment lesson time. What is it all about? Don't worry, let's go. It's about Remy Fentanyl. Remy Fentanyl. Have you heard about that medication before? Okay, let's go. The train enemy is Ortiva. It's a very strong analgesic of the class opioid aniloperidine group. For anesthesia, you can give intravenous infusion at the rate of 0 0.5 to 1 microgram per kilogram per minute. And could be given at the rate of 1 microgram per kilogram start before intubation. You can also give it as one microgram per kilogram per minute for coronary artery bypass graft. If you want to use it for post-operative pain, you can give it at the rate of 0 0.1 microgram per kilogram per minute and supplemental dose of 0 0.5 microgram per kilogram bolus. Then, if you choose to give it as infusion, postoperatively, you can give 0 0.025 microgram per kilogram per minute. What are the effects of remifentany? It has less respiratory depression. That is good to hear, right? But possibly respiratory depression will come up at dosages greater than 2 microgram per kilogram per minute. Then why is that a problem? I'm not going to give it up to that level, let alone going beyond, okay? So that my patient will be fine and I'll have peace of mind as well. You can give your oxygen if you're afraid. And if you need 0 0.1 microgram per kilogram per minute, could be given with midazolam. 0 0.05 microgram per kilogram per minute. Advantages here will be one is ultra short in action. So it's also short acting. You give it, you get the effect quickly, and it wanes down quickly also. It is clear by non-specific plasma esterase, and you're gonna get inactive metabolites. It would not accumulate in hepatic or renal failure. How about that? And somebody will ask me, what if it accumulates? After all, you are going to have inactive metabolites. So, what effects? None. Okay? Easy to reverse. Now, you are going to have the Reverse effect of analgesia and sedation once the medication is stopped. Why? It's short acting. The advantages, however, are there's possibility of recurrency of pain upon discontinuation mm -hmm. because it is ultra short acting. Glycine may accumulate in renal failure. Note this it can be used where fentanyl can't be used. No, it's really fentanyl, right? So when you have concern about you know, possible side effects and all the possible hazards of fentanyl, you can grab this you know, for a short time. But unlike fentanyl that could be attached as patch for 72 hours, it's just going to work for a few minutes. Okay? And with that, I come to the end of this presentation. Kindly subscribe to my channel so that once I have my presentation published, you'll be able to get a copy immediately. Thank you.